Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and welcome back to another video. Now, I have a question that I thought of recently, and it is, does Oblivion need major skills, or can it get rid of the major skill system and still be Oblivion? This is a very interesting question that I find myself asking, and I think it's worth talking about. So I think one of the benefits that Skyrim has over Oblivion is that it's more of an accessible game, for sure, by far. Skyrim is a more accessible game, it is very much more forgiving in terms of the skills. I think combat they're both about equally as unforgiving. So when it comes to Oblivion, you pick your major skills and you have your minor skills. The major skills are the ones that actually level you up. Now what's interesting is if you want to, you can level up your character efficiently, which is you take some of the minor skills and level them up, and then use the major skills to level yourself up. And then the attribute system, which is a separate skill system, those kind of like the skills are your abilities, and the attributes are the traits, and how good you are at traits, basically. Um, and you level up the traits based on the skill level ups you have. And the minor skills and major skills both kind of, a, they both give to the attribute system. So I'll give you an example. Strength. If you have punching, slicing, or axing, aka hand-to-hand, -hand, blade, and blunt, if you level up any set of those skills they add to when you actually level up, they add to the attribute. So if you just pick blade as your major skill, you don't just have to use blade to level up your character strength. You can punch and you can use an axe or mace or hammer. But the only way to progress your character's main level is with Blade. And this is where an interesting problem comes in. Is you can create a boss character, but still be fighting low-level enemies. And I almost feel like Oblivion would lose its personality if it didn't have any major skills in it. But I think that also the attribute system would suffer greatly if the major skills were gone. Let me explain. If every skill leveled you up, like just leveled you up in Oblivion without using the major skills, you couldn't get very many attribute buffs. So you would almost have to play as a jack of all trades. You would have to use a bow, have to use certain spells, and have to use melee all at once. And have to use like different armor. You have to use the same play style to be the best kind of character. Okay? Because getting that 5 plus to the attributes, you can't... I mean, it's, it's gonna, you're going to get a 5 plus if you want to when you level up, but you're not going to... Like, all, the, all your other attributes are going to get a 1 plus. And at any rate, you're probably just going to level up your attributes at the same pace anyways. But if you have the minor skills, you can almost complement your character and make him, or her, I guess, better if you want to. And it gives you the option to make an overpowered character for the high difficulty game, or if you just want to do a high high level character. But if you play the game normally, the system is balanced very, very well. I think that there's some things like endurance that are like super priority over other stuff, but overall it's a very balanced system. And I think major skills tie it all together with you being able to make a powerful character. Because if there was no major skills, you would get penalized if you leveled up your merchantile, or you leveled up your speechcraft, or you leveled up some stupid skill that you don't want. Like, if you don't want merchantile, but you're busy selling all your items, you level up merchantile once or twice, then that gets rid of the ability to put a point into something else. You have to put it into personality if you even want to level up in the first place. So Oblivion, with the way that it's built, needs its it needs its major skills, and I think that's why there's no attributes in Skyrim, is because if it had attributes, it would run into the same problem. Now you just level up your stamina, magic, or health, which I think is actually pretty good. And it's, I mean, it's a good replacement for the attributes. I don't think it's the most I ideal thing. Like I think there could probably be a better system. I don't know. But yeah, I think if you get rid of the major skills in Oblivion, it totally ruins the leveling system. And it doesn't make it work very well. And you're going to be busy fighting high-level enemies that 
you can't fight because your strength isn't as high as it should be, or your blade isn't as high as it should be, or some skill that you really should be good at is not going to be good enough. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. This is an interesting discussion. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Pacific Cash Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I'll see you in the next episode of Stream Blog or Steam It Post of whatever I decide to make.